Good morning everybody, this is Mario Makayaon in the Simulation Lab and here's a little tutorial that I'm putting together for you so that you guys can um, refer to this when you're doing your videotaping for your standardized patient encounters. Okay, so the first thing I'd like you to do is I'd like you to go down to this drop down menu and I want you to choose the Safari Safari icon. Once you do that you're going to be going to a username and you're going to plug in admin, A D M I N. The password is METI, M E T I. Once you do that, I want you to hit login and you will be in this METI Vision screen. Now, before anything else, what you're going to do is you're going to take your mouse or your pointer and you're going to go down to settings and you're going to click settings. and there you have it the, this is the room settings and what you need to do in room settings is you need to go to broadcast see how it says broadcast is stop you're gonna start broadcast okay and you're gonna save this okay now you're back to the original home screen but what you do see is you see this here with a green square this is what we're looking for alright so you're gonna click on the green square and it'll bring you into this window where you actually see the room from two different angles now um, once you're here um, you can actually manipulate the size of your window if you'd like um, I usually keep it this size here um, you can even go to camera control and you can choose from camera one or camera two to zoom in or to move the camera to the left this is camera one this is camera two so if you look over here on a drop screen it's camera one or two let's go ahead and go to camera one we can go ahead and hit the plus sign which means zoom and you can actually zoom into the room um, it takes a little bit for it to actually go in and um, I'm not going to actually wait for it but I do want you guys to, oh there it goes um, to be aware that you can actually uh, manipulate your cameras to a certain degree now beyond that what I do want to show you is this most important is this button here record is not active so hit the start recording and there you go you're actually recording you'll notice down here it says switching to re recording mode and there you are okay now if ever you guys decide um, if you're listening in on this patient encounter to write notes as this is going on what you can do is you can actually let's say um, type notes here in annotations and it will flag it so for example um, uh, student entering the room okay oh, sorry it's taking a little bit but it should populate this, hopefully. Okay, well, I'm not going to wait for it. Uh, there you go. All right, so once you do that, you hit that button, and it says student entering the room. You'll notice that it's actually stamped it at 48 seconds into the scenario. Um, say physical assessment beginning, or begins, rather. Right, hit that, and then you stamp it there. So, um, you can actually have this annotation if you want up here, okay, by minimizing the screen using the minimize button. And notice down here, you have your flags here at 48 seconds. This is what is um, stamped, student entering the room. And you down here, you do have a timer. So, if you um, reach 15 minutes or 18 minutes, um, like you, we always do on the other side, uh, knock on the door and let the participant uh, know that uh, time is up. So um, once everything is said and done, I want you all to come up here and hit that button, stop recording, and you're good to go. This is how to record your patient encounters. Thank you.